announcement, patients with broken wind arriving. Okay guys, back here for another episode. So I let it run on a little bit, but um, I didn't seem to be doing well on the money front. So, um, I don't know, I think there might be a... I'll uh, get him to wait. I think there might be an issue with my pricing. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my pricing and I'm going to put it up on all of them to 125. Um, and hopefully that will help us bring a bit more money in. Um, and then we can have a look at what we, what else we need to do from there. Um, apart from that, I think everything else is going okay. Um, no one seems particularly unhappy or happy. Um, so yeah. So this guy needs another diagnosis room. So let's see what diagnosis rooms we we can have. Um, and I'm not sure, it says that we've got an emergency, but, oh, it might be him. Um, no. I'm not actually sure where this emer emergency is. Um, let's just speed along. There it was, okay. Having surgery. Okay, so I've got that done, that's good. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to have a look here. Um, yeah, get just wait a little bit longer. So diagnosis. So we've got all of these. What we haven't got is the blood room, and we haven't got the X-ray. So I do have a bit of money. I could probably expand a little bit. So I'm going to do. I'm going to come over here. This might actually be a quite good spot for my clinics, but just for now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to put in a blood machine and uh, and an x-ray machine. So that's a small one. So that's six there. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put in an x-ray machine here. Like that. Um, that fits perfectly actually. Right in there. Um, I never can fit these things in properly but that seemed to go very well. So I'm gonna have to look at have a look at my doctors. I think I've got I think I've probably got quite a few doctors, um, maybe in training and stuff like that. So I've got what have I got? I've got three doctors wandering around, uh, four doctors wandering around. Um, so I've only I've got one, two, three, four, five rooms that require a doctor. Um, and uh, yeah, and I've got quite a few more doctors than that, so, so I'll send the handyman there to fix that one. Send the handyman over here to fix that one. If I can. Come on. Oh, okay. Well, that should be close to the case. Um, and also over here on the operating table, I'll send someone over to sort that out. That doesn't need any work. Anyway. Okay, so that's fine. I'm thinking I can probably fit the blood machine in down here. It might not be a good location for another GP's office. Oh! Two in a row, that's gonna go badly for me. Really hoping I don't lose any of my machines at that time. So let's block this down really quickly. And then have a look to see if there's any of my machines that need a little bit more work on them. So, why can't you fit? There you go. There you go. Radiator, plant in the corner. Everyone wants a bit of plant in their blood. And you know what? I'm going to have to change that because I want the door on this side so I can fit maybe something here if I get a bit cramped. Fire extinguisher in the corner. Actually. Got an emergency. Funeral, pa big Dave's funeral parlor and off license. Seven people with gut rot. Should be able to handle it. The bonuses are pretty abysmal, but I'm, you know, I'm ready to go for it. Um, okay, that's fine. Uh, maybe let's get some benches over here. Um, maybe a couple of ladies. Just keep people 
to get another reception desk that seemed to go relatively well for me last time. Some people went to the one reception desk and some people seemed to go to the other. I don't know whether that's my imagination, but... So you can still get past this, that's fine. So let's see. Um, no, I want to hire you, I don't want to close you. Uh, okay, you're the best one I can see. There you go. More past, excellent. Now I'm thinking I probably should have put that the other way around actually. So what's wrong with you? Bloaty head. Just wait a little while. What I'm gonna do, I'm gonna come up here. Um, I'm gonna put in a little inflation clinic now that someone needs that. Um, check that in there. Oh, I should just check that my emergency's going okay. So that's fine. Um, one day I will look it up and I will find out does it actually do anything by putting all those So you're on this big queue, you've got one, two, three, four, five, all killed. Uh, issue official invitation once you've already killed that person. Poor girl, poor girl. There she goes, up to heaven. Excellent. We're not very good at. Uh, not very good with our medicine, are we? So we've got an ultra scanner now. I'm gonna have to adjust this layout, I think, because first of all, that staff room is much too small. Um, I don't like these rooms being up here, because that's a diagnosis and then that's a clinic. Although well, it might not be the worst thing to have them all together. All my doctors seem to be trained up, so let's see if there's anyone cheap. So you're cheap. Else You're a surgeon, but I think I've got quite a few of those already. Yeah, okay. Um, so how many staff do I have? Let's see. Oh, I have none of my awfully small bonus. So I've got 13 doctors. So what are you doing in there? Why are you not learning? Um, good at everything. Um, okay. Uh, almost learned everything there. Uh, why don't you get in there and learn something? Um, again, why are you wandering around for? Get in there, have a sit down, do something. Oh, and now the train is going to rest. Excellent. Um, I've got some pretty poor doctors here. Um, so we've got C at least, so you can sit down as well. So you need to all be in there. So what do I need to do? Uh, diagnosis is depleted. So what should I do here? What should I get? So I do need an ultra scan, but I think that's quite a small room. Um, but I wonder whether to take it out. Maybe I'll take it out five, just so I can fit something else along this wall over here if I need to. So one of all of those. Oh, I got hairy-itis, man. So let's just find out, I suppose. I may end up needing to get a hair removal clinic. Um, I haven't even got a, uh, what's the other one, the slack tongue. I've got the fracture, but I haven't got the slack tongue. I'm just kind of waiting until all those requirements come in. So, now I've discovered spare ribs. So let's speed this along a bit and let's see what's happening. So, have you... You haven't learned everything, no. But you're heading for staffing anyway. So, what's happened to all my star? So, there's two people in there. Consultant, researcher, psychiatrist, researcher, surgeon. I don't seem to have very good star. Oh. You know what I might have done? No? I thought I might have loaded the wrong save game. Anyway, maybe that was my last hospital and I didn't realise. 
So I need one of these doctors to become a researcher, surgeon, psychiatrist. Ah, there you are. You need to become a great... Uh, you need to become a great consultant so you can teach them all everything. So in hindsight, I should have selected a good surgeon to go in there. Um, so you're in there. You're a consultant. Fine. We've got another surgeon who's not in training. So you've got everything. You just need to learn. So yeah, we're gonna have to be pulled out just you know just to get some surgery done. Quick bit of surgery. Be lovely. I need some more handyman actually. So, oh, you're an excellent handyman. So get in there, do some cleaning. Um, wait a little while because, to be honest, forty-one percent isn't the greatest. Ah, I'm having an emergency, and yet, ah. Right, guys. Um. Yeah, I don't really know exactly really what happened there, but um, apparently I decided, my mouse decided to kind of move around the screen everywhere. Um, okay, I know what I need to do. I need to get a hair restoration clinic. Um, I haven't got enough money. Um, my bank balance is dreadfully low. I've got a hell of a lot of doctors. Um, you are an excellent consultant and you can go and teach them all everything. In the meantime, however, I'm going to have to fire a load of my doctors. So, you, uh, you're very expensive, you only know those two things, get out the door. Well, you know nothing, get out the door. Um, yeah, again, you know, not great, and you're quite expensive still. You are very expensive. Off the trot. Okay. Hopefully now I've got a few better doctors on the go, so I don't know what you're doing precisely, but you should get yourself back in there. Okay. You've been kicked out. Excellent. Okay, let's get some more handymen. Um, for some reason, everyone seems to be vomiting everywhere. And, yeah, not using the bins provided. Um, and it also looks like maybe I need some more benches, but I also can't buy those because I haven't got any money. So, yeah, I'll pay you. Excellent. Okay. Everything's okay. I've got three nurses. I'm not sure if I need all of them. And, oh my gosh, there's an astronomical queue. So, I'm sure I'm about to lose. Um, I shouldn't go less than a thousand, but I'm about to take out a loan of five thousand. What we're going to do is we're going to put in a GP's office over here. Very quickly, get some of these people over here. Um, that's a nice layout. Lovely. Warmth in there. Um, and off we go. Yeah, a load of people coming over. Um, 4,000. I really need to get rid of that loan because I've gone 500 below. Um, just, just wait a little while. So there I was thinking I was going to run it on a bit and um, yeah, make some money. How wrong I was. I uh, can't even get people to go to the GP's office. You know, there we go, there's 130 quid I've been losing out on. You know, another 1400, so that was no time at all. So this guy's about to die, so let's get him up the queue. Okay, he's right at the front of the queue now. Okay, so a little bit of money. Um, I'm not doing great. My hospital's not doing amazingly. I always have this way. This one person with kidney beans, and all you get is a thousand bonus. It's hardly worth it, is it? Um, you know what? It must be fractured bones. I mean, may as well just take a chance. Um, yeah, I mean, look at him. He's definitely got fractured bones. What could possibly be wrong? There we go. Happy as Larry. Um, 
guy with the emergency is in the queue, but he's at the front of the queue at least, so that's good. Then you come, there's your little tushy. Then you get a bit of gas, bit of knife, cut straight through the gown. Excellent, move the light. Ah, oh, walk off, happy Larry. Don't even have to be re walk, wheeled in and out. Um, okay, so we've got a bit of an issue here, so that's a thousand, excellent. Um, right, so get you to wait a little while because of boldness. Um, you wait a little while, um, yeah, you can have your money, you can have your money. Um, yeah, just, just wait a little while, um, right, wow, what? I'm, I'm not sure where that money came from. Um, I, I may well have missed something, but anyway, I'll uh, declare an epidemic. Um, because my money has gone absolutely through the roof, and I'm not quite sure how. Where did I get all that money from? Where the... Did I have some balances outstanding with the, uh, insurance company? I really don't know. Um, I don't want that one, I want the graphs. So I'm not sure what happened there. My balance just shot up. Um, I'm not quite sure. Um... Okay, it feels like a cheat, but I didn't... I know there is a cheat, you can use... You can use a fax... When you get a fax coming, you can dial numbers on the fax machine, and the younger self did that quite a lot. However, I didn't intend to do any cheating in this game, so I'm a bit confused about that one. So you just wait a while, because we've got a bit of money now, so we'll just get it at normal speed. Plodding along lovely. So, we need a hair restoration clinic, so you can fit in there nicely. So, pop that on. I'm just getting better actually for my illness. You might hear still a little bit, uh, a bit gravelly and, you know, a few sniffs every now and then, so apologies for that. Um, yeah, I've not been very well at all. Um, I've been carrying on going to work, but, you know, even so, I could really do with a bit more sleep than I'm currently getting. So we've sorted all that um, bugginess out, so that's good. So let me just double check, I've got my wage requests grant. Yes, excellent. Um, what have we got? Nine people with infectious... Ah, uh, I see. Maybe my bonus was 10,000, not 1,000. So that's a bonus of 18,000, if I get infectious laughter right. So yes, I'm ready. Um, I'm guessing infectious laughter is the psychiatric? Um, so, you know everything. You don't know everything, but you're doing surgery. Um, you could probably do with training a little bit. Oh no, don't do that. So, you train in there, lovely. Okay. Um, wow, that's a lot of you. Um, okay, I'll tell you what, I really need to get, I think, another psychiatric over here, I need to fit something in here I think, so that's a, that's a six there, if I can fit, maybe I'll do that and I can put like a, I don't know, a ward or another operating theatre down there, um, you've, you've probably noticed my style is to kind of cram everything in as much as I possibly can, so um, I'm not intending to change that. Uh, screwed that up a little bit. Um, okay, uh, let me just pick that up. Um, and let me pick up the bookcase, pick up that, pick up that. Okay, um, you know what? I never put these more in the middle of the room, and I, I, I don't know whether it's possible, but. That's a much better layout. So there we go, that looks quite pleasant actually in there. Um, so half you are going over here. Um, you are consultant, researcher, psychiatrist. And there we go. Um, send patient. No, just wait a while because slack tong I can easily do. So basically, what's happened here is everyone started coming to my hospital and I haven't got everything set up and ready in the right place yet. So, get that in there, excellent. One of all of these. Um, uh, plant there, in near the door on your way out. 
um, any Doctor Consort out slapped on, um, which is lovely because I'm going to need someone to come down there in just a moment um, for this lovely lady coming down to have her tongue sliced and diced. Um, I think I'd be a bit upset if I went to the hospital and I came out and they chopped half my tongue off, but they seem quite happy about it here. Um, a couple of drinks machines keep people uh, hydrated, one there as well, excellent. Might want to move that one so I can fit a room in here or something. Um, you know what I'm going to do is I'm going to put in... I did this on the last level as well, but let's see what my layout is. Um, maybe what I'll do is I'll put in a staff room down here. I just I like to keep the small staff rooms. Um, if I can make it a bit longer, I think. Put that in there, and then what that does is that means people who are, people can come down here. They can go to this staff room, um, or that if they prefer, they can go down the other end and uh, go to the staff room down there. And it really kind of depends a lot more. On, that's probably a little bit too warm down there, so we'll leave it at that. Um, they can decide which staff room to go to, and then that, what that means is. We don't have people constantly walking back and forth trying to go to the staff room. So, what have we got? This guy, researcher, surgeon, psychiatrist. Um, just wait a little while longer. I don't know where you are though. So let's put it on uh, just normal speed. Where's that person waiting? So she's over there. Um, so I'll tell you what, I'm doing very well on the money front now. So 75, that's a good one. Um, that's like the going rate for a cheap, cheap young doctor. Um, for the time being, because I, I do need a bit more. Ah, there's an additional researcher there. Um, I didn't really want to do that, okay. Um, let's see. Oh, oh, pretty r rubbish. Crap, actually, I'll get rid of you. Um, okay, so she's sitting down now. She's wondering what to do, really, about the whole thing. Having something to drink. Excellent. I suppose that's the upside of having people wait a long time for their treatment. But they spend a bit more money on the uh, on all the drinks machines. So I wonder, it might not be pretty. I fit that in there. I can fit a clinic over here. What I think I'll do, um, and then I can buy the next lot and work out how to do a nicer layout. Then, okay, so one of all of these, uh, flip it round, excellent, put that in there. Okay, any doctor, excellent. Okay, an emergency, three people with spare ribs, yes, I'm ready. I'm gonna have to keep an eye on that one though. Okay, 2000 cash gone. Um, just wait a little while. Serious radiation. Okay, I'll, I'll treat that one just shortly. So what else have I got here? So uh, maybe I'll put in the decontamination. Um, does that fit down there? No, it doesn't fit down there. Um, have I got a hair restoration? Yeah, I've got one of them. Electrolysis? Is, that looks like a big room as well. Um, yeah, so I can't fit that in either. I was sure I'd be able to fit something down here. So, I've got now all of them. Um, got inflation, slack tongue, fracture, hair restoration. So, okay, I need a couple more of those. Um, maybe this design of the hospital wasn't the best then. So, I've got a GP's office down here. So, what I'll do, because I feel like you can't have too many pharmacies. So I'll put a pharmacy in down here. Um, it's not the ideal location, it's tucked away somewhat, especially with that door there. Um, and the radiator over here. Uh, let's put it over here, keep the room warm. Um, plant, nicely in sight. Excellent. Decides I don't want bin. Oh no, there was a bin. Okay, that's good. So a nurse can come in there. So, ah, uh, so you're there now. Um, do I have 
any surgeons. So you're currently what looks like okay, you're GP officing. We'll get in there and do some surgeoning. That's what we gotta do. There's a big bonus on the loose. Alright. Cut, cut, cut. Oh, did I kill you? No, you're happy. Okay. Wow, it's a good amount of money each time. So, uh, just, just wait a little bit. I'll get that radiation. I'm just making sure that they do their job properly. And there we go. I think that was it all. So, what did I get? I got 3,600. Not too bad. So, what I'm gonna do... I'm going to just buy another area. So, just keep going that way. Yeah, well, I like that. I like just keeping on going, you know, follow it around. So what we'll do is I'll get clinic. So I do need the electrolysis and I need the decontamination. So I wonder whether I put something here. Um, yes, I think I put that there. Corridor down there. Um, there we go. Decontamination unit straight in there. Ping pong, ping pong. Oh, lovely. Around there. Um, and excellent. There we go. Decontamination shower requires any doctor. It also needs maintaining by a handyman. So, it's for radiation. It cleanses them off of the horrid radioactivity and muck. So, this guy, I think they make him look like a spy. I don't know whether intentionally or not. Oh, no, I don't want 10 of those. Uh, let's get a load of benches in. Um, okay, um, here as well. You never know when you can need, when you might need somewhere to sit. And I'll put these here because if you remember this area down here doesn't really have anywhere to sit. So that would give people the opportunity to have a sit down before. Um, before they head into their appointment, put the gap along here, the night, yeah. Um, and I'll put one of those in there. Um, I think we could do some more drinks machines actually. Maybe I'll chuck one in there. Uh, I've got one there already, I've got one there already. Uh, a couple in the entrance, yeah. Okay, I'll put one more there. And that, that should be plenty. So I've got decontamination sorted. Um, I'm thinking now I need... What else do I need? Oh! So what was that? So anything broken? That's okay. That's okay. I mean, it could do with sending a handyman, but... For some reason it doesn't really want to send my handyman. So that's fine. Ultra scanner. Yeah, I'll send someone along. Oh, you're doing very poorly, so get someone along there straight away. Um, the worst thing in this game. Oh no! Please no! Oh, please stop. Oh, yeah. Oh, yes. I really need. You know what? I'm going to hire some more handymen quickly. Oh, you get in there and you. All I want you to do is repair machines. Repair the machine. Uh, yeah. Okay, go in there. Excellent. Um, I don't care what else you do, just go in there. Repair machines. Get everything sorted out big time. Okay, excellent. So, official invitation. Yeah, please come along, have a look. Everything's looking a little bit better now. Okay, you've been repaired. You don't need a repair. Excellent. Okay, we're back on track. Oh no, we've got an epidemic. Um, we've got a bit of money. I'll just declare an epidemic and uh, take the hit. Although I do need that reputation to get up, so I'm probably going to have to think about that a bit, um, a bit more next time. I'm going to fit you in there. I quite like this corridor here and then I'll have a corridor down here as well. Um, I'll leave the door on that side for now because that's where people are mostly going to be coming from. Um, right, that doesn't fit. Uh, it's very funny this game, the way that... It, I, don't, 
I don't know exactly like how you're meant to make this all fit properly. Um, because am I meant to turn that round and then that round? Or am I meant to put this over here? See, I just I can't make. Oh, I think this is the one who might have the biggest issue with. Um, so I can't put that in front of the door. I'm just gonna have to move the door, I think. Let's see what happens if I put the door there. Um, okay. So put that there. No. Oh, okay. Um, maybe put the door on this side of the room. Does that change things? Poorly designed, the fact that you can't just fit the stuff in the room. Like, I think the items are just too big and obviously that's a bit of an issue because of the, you know, the square, you know, grid layout of the board. Electrolysis room. Pa patients with hairyitis are directed to this room where a special machine called the electrolyzer yanks out the hairs and seals the pores electrically using a compound not unlike grout. That sounds disgusting. The electrolysis room requires any doctor. I have a bit of an issue there. Also needs maintenance by a handyman. I have a little drink to celebrate the new electrolysis room. Excellent. So, what have I not got? So I've got an x-ray, I've got a blood machine, I've got a scanner, I've got an ultra scanner, cardiogram, general, I've got the whole shebang. Now this ward's probably getting a bit over utilised. Um, psychiatric, I've got the ward, I've got operating theatre and I've got two pharmacies. Inflation, slap tongue, fracture, hair restoration, electrolysis clinic and decontamination. I've got a whole bunch of all the facilities as well. Um, you know what, I'll get some more of these junior doctors. It's always good to train people up, give them the opportunity to learn something new. So that's a goal. He's teaching them, he's teaching them. So what I really want is I want everyone with all the all the skills, basically. Um, you know, I'd like you to be in there, actually, to be honest. Um, it might not be a bad idea to... Okay, actually, you're, you've got all of that already, so you stay in there. And obviously you're asking for more pay because you level up and you just ask for more pay. Um, another epidemic. Okay, I'm going to cure you all. I'm going to find you where you are. Oh, there you are. Okay, quickly, before, before nurse sees you. Okay, nurse is looking at you. Um, any more? There you are. Yeah, please. Okay, let's turn that off. So how do we do? So we've not cured all that many and we've killed quite a few. Um, so, wow, that's a big boost of reputation. Um, so my values are good. Um, so I'm getting a bit of money. Um, so we're getting there and look at that reputation. So let's have a... I think what we'll do is uh, I'm sorry about the little uh, you know technical hiccup in the middle. I don't know exactly what happened there, but we'll leave it here for now. We've got a pretty good hospital. It's a nice size. I like the dimensions of it as well. Um, I'm thinking I might put a ward or something down here and move the ward from up here. Do a bit of rejigging, put you know the clinics together and some of the diagnosis together. And I'll, I'll probably wait till next time to do that, or, or maybe I'll do it off camera. Um, but thank you very much for watching, and uh, we'll, I'll see you next time.